In today's video, we're going to be talking about how important it is to maintain the long-term vision while stacking the silver and the gold and completely letting go of the need for instant gratification. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Hope you're doing well, feeling great, and enjoying freedom. It's a great day to have a great day. Today, I wanted to talk about silver and also a little bit of gold and the importance of not worrying about the short term while you're stacking, getting rid of the need for instant gratification and replacing it with delayed gratification. This is life changing. We're going to get into it, but really quick, just in case you're new. Make sure to subscribe for daily videos. Also subscribe to my second channel, which is my backup channel for exclusive weekly content. Brand new video over there. Go check it out. The link will be in the description. And if you want to get some DYDSS merchandise to help support the channel, I would really, really, really appreciate it. Any and all merchandise can be found by clicking the first link in the description section down below. Thank you in advance. It's more than appreciated. But today is Saturday, July 3rd, 2021. Happy Independence Month, everybody. It's actually Friday the 2nd as I'm recording the video, so I have no idea what the spot price is going to be by the time this video is released. So head on down to the comments and let me know the date and time you're viewing the video and what the current spot price is for you. I'm always curious. But today I wanted to talk about delayed gratification. And if you're wondering what that is, I'm going to get into it momentarily. Long story short, it's the complete and total opposite of instant gratification, something that requires self-discipline, something that requires self-respect, something that requires a long-term vision focusing on several years, potentially several decades, maybe even several generations down the line, focusing on the future and not the present. So what I'm going to do in this video is include a clip from the Wednesday night live stream that I did in the VIP club. I'll leave the link in the description in case anybody wants to become a VIP club member. Weekly live streams, monthly giveaways, daily silver and gold deal alerts, and much, much more. The clip that I'm going to be showing, believe it or not, is about nine minutes long. Of those nine minutes, the first six minutes talks much more about a book along with investing, along with reinvesting dividends and reinvesting profits back into your business. I'm going to leave that in even though this is a video about silver and gold just for added context. If you want to skip over it, just skip the next six minutes and after that it's going to be full in detail regarding silver and gold. Here's the clip. Here we go. And on the way back, I stopped by the P.O. box. And if and when Debonair Dillon gets here, I have to thank him too, because he sent me something as well. But Andrew, I did receive... I have the envelope right here. Letter received. Letter appreciated. And also... Thank you very much for the book. A book that we talked about during... I don't know if it was the last live stream or the stream before that. Get Rich With Dividends. And I said that was a book that I'm pretty sure had, was already on my list of books to eventually get, but I made a deal with myself not to buy a single new book until I read through 10 more books that I already bought because I was buying books faster than I could read them and I had to come to an abrupt halt. But surprise, surprise, you sent the book my way. Thank you very much. I know the, uh, the camera angle isn't really doing much justice, but get rich with dividends. I know we also talked a little bit about the compound effect during one of the recent streams, and I even made an entire video about the compound effect. But I was referencing silver when I talked about the compound effect. There is something 
anybody who's familiar with dividends and dividend investing, they've probably heard of the term compound interest, which essentially means reinvesting your dividends. So with Andrew's help, you kept your word and didn't buy another book. Yeah, that, that, that's right. That's right. Thank you very much once again, Andrew. Really appreciate the book. I'm looking forward to reading it. I reinvest all my dividends at this point. Retirement in five years. Yeah, that's good. I don't think now is the time to be spending dividends. Now is the time to be reinvesting. And same could be said about running a small business as a side hustle right now. Now is not the time to be spending the profits. Now is the time to be reinvesting it back into the business. Delayed gratification. People have become too accustomed to instant gratification. You want something right now and boom, it's right there in front of you. Now as convenient as it is, to text somebody and then reply back within 30 seconds or to put something out there on the internet and get immediate feedback or to place an order online and it arrives in like 36 hours because you bought it on Amazon as nice as that is I think convenience is Oftentimes, one might actually be able to argue, the devil in disguise. But the opposite of instant gratification is delayed gratification, which is what I'm talking about right now. Reinvesting your dividends. Reinvesting your business's profits back into the business. Self-discipline to hold off and keep plowing forward keep trucking along because later on down the road when it's time to retire or when it's time to scale back you'll be happy that you did I personally believe things will be much more enjoyable later down the road I'm a big believer in the long term I'm a big believer in the long haul I'm not here for today, tomorrow, and this weekend. I'm here for several decades into the future. I'm here for years down the road. That's what I'm thinking about. See, I think about legacy. I don't think about having fun next week. I'll have fun next week. But that's not my primary concern. My primary concern is to build something for myself that could potentially set me up for the rest of my life. And guess what? That might not happen. It might not work. But you want to know what else won't work? Not even bothering to try. Which is why I put everything I have into everything I do. I like the way things are going. I like the way things are headed. I have a long way to go before I'm even 1% of the way to where I want to be. But I see the progress happening in real time. I see it working. And guess what? Every month gets a little bit better. Blood, sweat, and tears. It's brutal. It's difficult. The early mornings and the late nights and the nonstop, nonstop, nonstop all day long in between, five, six, seven days a week, every single week, for at this point, over five years straight, no breaks. Again, not to pat myself on the back and say, oh, look at how hard of a worker I am. It's not what I'm saying here. It's all delayed gratification. I believe hard work pays off. And I believe everything I'm doing will pay off. I believe that to be true. Work hard to buy dividend stocks and work smart by reinvesting dividends. Same for stacking silver. Basically, work hard to acquire. Work smarter by delaying gratification. Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. That's the way to do it. And, and times like these, well, I'll speak for myself because I know 
not everybody has been stacking for multiple years, but I got a majority of my stack for less than 20 bucks. Now, if you want to part ways with any of your silver, you're probably not going to get less than 30 bucks for each individual troy ounce. So a lot of people, like myself, who picked up silver eagles, maples, generic bars, rounds, everything, for 15, 16 bucks an ounce, premium included, have essentially doubled the dollar bill value of the stack. Because we put about $15, $16 per troy ounce in, maybe a little bit more. I'll be generous and say $17 or $18 an ounce. And nowadays, due to the spot price going up and the premiums going way up, I could cash out for probably double what I put in. But guess what? That's not something somebody would do if they were focusing on delayed gratification. I'm in it for years, decades down the road. Plan on keeping it that way. I have no desire to sell. There's nothing I need to sell for. But I don't care what spot price does. I wouldn't sell unless I absolutely had to. Now, I don't necessarily plan on holding on to every single piece of silver for the rest of my life, no. As I always say, I'd like to take some silver and put it into gold when it's the right time to do so, when the gold to silver ratio gap closes in a little bit. Later on down the road, who knows, maybe a little bit of gold for a little bit of land. And who knows what's after that? Rinse and repeat, maybe? Delayed gratification. These things take time. Business, stocks, real estate, stacking silver, stacking gold, buying land, or using the silver to get gold and using the gold to get land, that all takes time. There is no instant gratification in this game. And if there is, you're probably doing it wrong. Okay, so that right there was a nine minute clip from a, believe it or not, almost four hour long live stream. Once again, I go live every Wednesday night in the VIP club. I also do monthly giveaways, daily silver and gold deal alerts, and a bunch of other stuff as well. Link in the description. If you would like to join, I'd really appreciate it. I guarantee you the value exceeds the cost. But I wanted to do a little bit of a continuation. Everything that I shared right there in that nine-minute clip, more specifically, everything that I shared in the last three minutes of that nine-minute clip, being that the first six minutes were more so about stocks and business and whatnot. I left it in because I wanted the context to be there. I wanted to give everybody a slightly better understanding rather than just diving straight into the silver and the gold. But back to the precious metals, I just wanted to reiterate because I believe it's important to stay patient. I believe it's important to trust the process. I believe it's important to stay consistent. And I believe it's important to let go of that need for instant gratification. I know a lot of people get easily distracted when the spot price does something kind of weird. If the spot price goes up by a little bit, I know a lot of people out there get really tempted to sell. I know a lot of people out there get really tempted to cash out or roll around in the dollar bills. I know a lot of people out there are sitting on the edge of their seat with their fingers crossed, hoping and praying for spot price to just skyrocket in a moment's notice. I know that there are a lot of people out there who are doing that right now, and I'm not going to sit here and say that they're wrong. I'm not going to sit here and belittle them. I'm not going to sit here and ridicule them or anything like that. But in my humble opinion, I think if that's what you're looking for, you might be playing the wrong game because silver and gold is more so of a way to store value rather than a way to see explosive growth. I do believe silver especially silver, but also gold as well, I do believe we are going to see tons of capital appreciation in the long term. I don't know all that much about the short term right now, but like I said, I'm not worried about the short term. I'm not even worried about the midterm. I'm worried about the long term. I'm not thinking about this weekend. I'm thinking about my retirement. And I think that right there 
that long-term perspective and letting go of the need for instant gratification has made the process much, much, much easier. Not to say it was difficult in the first place. I've been enjoying the process since day one. I genuinely, thoroughly enjoy stacking silver and gold. It's something that I consider to be fun. It's something that I consider to be somewhat of a cross between a hobby and a lifestyle. I just simply enjoy it. And I truly believe that I will be reaping the benefits long term. But I want you guys to head on down to the comments and let me know anything and everything related to today's video topic. And what are your thoughts on delayed gratification, especially delayed gratification when it comes to stacking the precious metals? And if anybody's interested in joining the Precious Metals VIP Club, it's where I can do things on my own terms. Not on YouTube's terms. My terms. I'm hosting privately held live streams. They're smaller and easier to manage. I'm posting exclusive VIP only adventure vlogs. I also do giveaways, discounts, personalized promo codes, shout outs, deal alerts when silver and gold is on sale on a variety of different websites. And of course you can watch all of my videos early and commercial free. Come join the Precious Metals VIP club. It'll be the first link in the description. You're invited. I'd be happy to have you. And if you guys enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button. If you guys like me, make sure to hit that subscribe button like a Karen hits a bus window. Also subscribe to my second channel, which is my backup channel for exclusive weekly content. Bunch of brand new videos over there. I posted one about China banning cryptocurrency, one about AT&T cutting its dividend, other videos about real estate, videos about silver, videos about gold, and a bunch of others go check them out the link will be in the description trying really hard to hit 3,000 subscribers we just hit 2,000 and I appreciate that and if you want to help support the channel in the biggest possible way please consider getting yourself some DYDSS merchandise of course we have some precious metal themed t-shirts and hoodies which are up for grabs along with a ton of other products t-shirts, hoodies, even stickers, many of which are raising funds and awareness for different charity organizations, such as the recently released Kraken Stacken t-shirt, hoodie, sticker, and coffee mug, inspired by the beautiful two ounce silver Kraken coin, which by the way is helping us raise a little bit of funds and awareness for ocean cleanup charity organizations at no additional cost to you, it comes out of my pocket, not yours. And of course, last but not least, the brand new DYDSS Karen Free Zone t-shirt, hoodie, sticker, and coffee mug. My name is not Karen. Any and all merchandise can be found by clicking the first link in the description section down below. Thank you in advance. It's more than appreciated. And I want you guys to head on down to the comments and let me know once again. What are your thoughts on everything shared in today's video? Of course, the primary focal point was talking about delayed gratification when it comes to stacking silver and gold, but I hope everybody understands what I was really trying to do in today's video. It's not just about delayed gratification when it comes to silver and gold. It's about delayed gratification when it comes to absolutely everything. Maintaining the long-term vision, not letting go of something just because it's not working today moving forward, plowing through the rough days, the red days when it comes to the metals, the red days when it comes to the stock market, the dark days that you might be going through if you're dealing with something in your personal life. It's all about delayed gratification. You're not supposed to feel and experience and have everything that you want at this very specific point in time. You need to trust the process. So head on down to the comments and let me know anything and everything related to today's video topic. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you tomorrow. And remember, don't you dare stop smiling. Peace.